So let's uh, go ahead and read it with that. Okay. Which is this deal? It's in Hearst, Texas. Love it. Three bedroom, two bath, two car garage, 2,100 square feet, built in 1965. This is perfect the way you put this in here. So our smart pricing yeah. average, thank you, Jameson, is $244,831. We have an accepted offer at $200,000, uh, 200834 17 cents. 200 grand. Yes. But there is a tenant in the property month to month. This is, no this problem. is going great. We have two properties yeah. right now that we're buying with tenants in them. So it's tenant the property month to month and we're working it out when we can visit in person. Landlord is out of state. From what we currently know, it seems like it's in good condition. Okay, this is this. Okay, so none of that bothers me. Love it. I love all of it. I love Hearst. Hearst. You do? Yeah, Hearst, Euless, and Bedford. I don't know that little area. Those are those are really good moving. Um, do you call when I say middle class? Is it okay to say middle class for the 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 three? What do we call the tri area there? But um, I'm looking. F- I'm looking for you to, if you have some stuff, put it in chat, Jameson, so I can read it there. So, uh, the Mid-Cities, thank you. I know that area. So, all of this, I mean, all of that warrants itself, all of it, to take it to the absolute next level. What I would check for now, uh, and I'm just trying to do that right here in front of us all, is uh, completed sales. Yeah. I'm also re- uh, assuming that. Days on market. The, yeah, I'm assuming that the days on market are okay because you did a DOM, you went through the red, green, yellow, and please respond here, uh, Jameson, in the, in the chat. Yeah, in the chat. It's easier. I'm assuming you went through all of that uh, in the red, green, yellow to choose a market to send out mail. And then number two, what we're doing right now, we're actually purchasing a property that's in an HOA again because it's such a good deal. And now I'm going back and running in the now, in a, uh, a days on market analysis and uh, some other stuff for that subdivision because it's such a large master plan community and so far so good on all of it. Let's check uh, actual comparison values here. You know what, so far what I'm seeing right now, you know, I'll tell you right now, Jameson, everything you just put in right now, I would totally tell you, I would be going down the path that I'm doing the deal. I'd be in their house this afternoon, getting my eyes on the place taking some pictures. And if I like what I see, I'd have an inspector coming out tomorrow and then I'll know everything. So what's today? So then on Friday afternoon, tomorrow afternoon, all I can make my decision for sure and say, yep, we're, we're moving forward. 2,100 feet is great. And I love that as a tenant that's month to month because I would keep the tenant in there too, by the way, because who your buyer is, they might want it. They might not. They, they have, they can just give them 30 days notice and, or depending how the lease is written, not even, <laughs> If you want, to leave, it'd be nice to give 30 days. I think that's cool. But um, Texas is a non disclosure right. state, so look at the comparison values. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. That's how I am. That's how I, that's how when I like to answer everything that way. N A, N A, N A. So do I. <laughs> All right, so 200. We need to find this asset. Just southeast of the freeway, right here. Mm-hmm. Oops, that tells us the whole thing. Mm-hmm. It's right there. I love it. Two hundred. If our screen show or anything's not working out, let it be sure. Let us know. Two thirty-five, two eighty-nine, two forty-nine, two hundred two. So we'd have to do a pretty intense square footage analysis, but it looks like you'd be okay selling it for two two forty. I love $40, it. Forty thousand dollars, assuming that it doesn't need anything at all. But it's these little two hundreds that fourteen hundred square feet. Hope you can see the screen. 1,800 square feet for 250. This is probably a large commercial dirt deal. 1,800 square feet, 235. And here we go. So 2,100 feet for almost 300,000. So I, I, um, 
I'm feeling great about this. Hey, you know what? Humor me here. If I mean, you really wanted to find something wrong, if you really want to dig and get some some real sale comps, follow me here. This is how I think. I like to be a detective. I bet I could go sift. I could find get the neighbors' addresses. We all know how to do that, real easy. And I could pull up the neighbor properties in um, like Title Pro, Title Pro, and find mortgage information and see what the mortgages are around the area. If you really want to know, you know, because you could see, you could probably find somebody that sold recently. Go in Title Pro and see if they had a mortgage and what the mortgage amount was. Might that might give you some insight. So, cool. I this, like it. This is, uh, I would sign this up right now. You know, another thing we just oh. learned on this advanced call, and, and we all know this, but we probably get lackadaisical about it, is what Joe referred to earlier is with speed. Like, okay, so this is a great deal. I hope you're on the phone with them. I hope you're arranging to cl- for closing. I hope that you're really in their ear. And uh, hope you're in your car right now driving to their house to see it. Whatever, yeah. You know, saying, I need to get in there. So... I I would totally I love this I love this area I love this deal. Me too. Can't go. I really think that all those houses around there are awesome. 